Okay folks, just a quick video to show you how to make magnesium water following the recipe of Dr. William Davis, who is the author of Wheat Belly and Undoctored. I'm a big fan of his. He's a, um, out of the goodness of his heart, uh, helping a lot of people uh, with his approach to uh, becoming undoctored and uh, particularly in the areas of, of uh, nutrition and preventative medicine where the uh, medical profession sort of falls falls uh, comes up short. Um, Dr. Davis is is helping a lot of people. So here's how you make his magnesium water, which I use. My elderly mother also uses it, and she found that her uh, leg cramps went away uh, immediately when she started taking it. So um, anyway, here's what you do. The, the, the hardest part is to get the right ingredients, and it's not that hard. Here in the Midwest, I go to Hy-Vee grocery store chain. I purchase seltzer water, two-liter bottle. I get them for 89 cents a bottle. Sometimes I put them on sale for 50 cents. That's when I back up the truck. But the generic brand of Milk of Magnesia, it's just a knockoff of uh, Philips Milk of Magnesia. Philips didn't work for me because their uh, stuff had sodium hypochlorite in it. And Dr. Davis explicitly says don't get Milk of Magnesia with sodium hypochlorite in it. And don't get flavored Milk of Magnesia. Get the original flavor which is basically unflavored. So this is $2 or $3.99. This will last you eight servings, eight weeks basically. And one of these big bottles lasts me a week. So basically the cost works out to five bucks a month, which is dirt cheap. And the stuff, the, the magnesium water comes in real handy for uh, washing down uh, whatever other pills and uh, tablets you may take. So here's what you do. Here's the exciting part. You got... Uh, you, you put 45 milliliters in the cap, thereabouts. I'm just about out, down to my last bit on this bottle here, so I'm coming up just a little bit short here, but that's okay. Now here's where it gets exciting. Here's where we create the chemical reaction. We're going to put magnesium hydroxide in the milk of magnesia in the seltzer water. Be sure to get seltzer water and not club soda, which have the, uh, has other minerals in it, or tonic water, which has sugar in it, which you certainly don't want. So we're gonna create a chemical reaction here. The magnesium hydroxide is gonna react with the seltzer water to create magnesium bicarbonate, which Dr. Davis says is the most absorbable form of magnesium. So here we go. So the reaction is taking place. You can see the bubbling and the, uh, the water has turned sort of murky. And in about two minutes here it's going to clear up. Put the cap back on. You don't need to refrigerate it as long as you consume it within about a week or so you'll be good. And uh, it doesn't have much of a taste to it. It's certainly uh, not an offensive taste or anything like that. Uh, like I said, it's handy to wash down the pills. So yeah, that'll clear up in a couple of minutes. And uh, for five bucks a uh, a month, you've got uh, a real nice uh, magnesium water supplement. Good luck.